over to Newmarket now then, where we've got a one mile four furlong race on what is virtually a straight course. Be much better than staying at Ascot where there's a sharp turn into the straight here. There's just one turn which is basically the more the kick there you can see it there look, as we have the bit of a flyby so I'm not quite sure why we didn't have a 10 foot on race we've jumped straight up to a mile and a half uh, three rods up once again at the top line star Alex Cherry shambles David Robertson Bally Galley straight or Bally Galley straight Derek Hinton has also got white lightning hoodie for Joshua Sutherland German Street and Renava for Martin Leedham Giant Blake and Senior Patches for Matt Cooper, see what you want for Munas, Southern Man, Obi Wan, Asa Campestra, and Visions of Heresy for Padre Hogan, Groom Me Grey for Stu Grey, Sashi Lady Alex Cherry, Mug Rancher for Craig Beckwith, Las Trapanga, Darren Thompson, Natalie Portman, and Shimra Camellia, Dan Hughes, pretty sure they were both around last season, Provence Share Faster for David Robertson, Black Heart, Joshua Sutherland, Queen Green, Obi Wan, Fujin Star, and Santa Rosa Isati for Vinnie Gerard, going for a quick fire double Empire for Munas, Magnus Mendelssohn, Paul Rhodes, Sarsal Park, Darren Thompson, and Empire of Angels, Paul Rhodes at the bottom, 28 again then. And all ready to go, and away they go. No old trip, and Magnus Mendelssohn has gone off into the lead. Magnus Mendelssohn, who ran last week, although, of course, with these tries, I don't know what guys they ran, and they're maybe a year older this week. I mean, a two year old that we saw last time. Anyway, White Line is in the lead now, and the nose banded Black Heart. Joshua Sutherland seems to be experimenting with nose bands in the last season or two. Doesn't seem to be stopping him from. I mean, the winners, and White Lightning has gone on for Derek Hinton. So, White Lightning, the first of the Greys, is about three lengths clear of Black Heart, who's in second. Gap of two lengths then to Empire, who's showing third. Then a big clump of them together, the grey head of Fujin style. Probably just showing him fourth. Sarsar Park is also in that little group. The widest one in that group there is German Street, looking towards the back. Queen Green is just the early back marker, with also the Gray from the Dan Hughes stable, Shimna Chameleon, but watch that one finishing late as he's usually do. And it's White Lightning in the lead then by about five or six lengths to Black Heart in second. Groomy Gray has now come through to make a bit of a forward move. Then German Street wide on the track, and then inside of that one is Provence Share Faster. Fujin Style is also trying to get going and towards the back. It's still Queen Green who trails the tails, but White Lightning's got a five length lead at this point then from Province here, faster right over on the far side second. The neck grey Fujin style, German Street on the outside. Hoodie is now coming through. Empire of Angels and Bally Galley straight are also there. And La Trapanga is coming through with a strong looking run as well. And Renava and Blackheart are not out of it. Magnus Magnus has lost his place, but he's trying to be pushed back along again. But White Lightning is still showing the way. It leads only by about three now to Hoodie in second. Fujin style, Empire of Angels. Magnus Magnus is now getting, going again on the inside. And then German Street and La Trapanga. Panga and uh, Groomy Grey is still there as well. Also, Giant Blake is trying to run into it. Renava's not that far away, but it's White Lightning who's in the lead from Fujin Style and Magnus Middleton. It's a three way grey at the front. It's White Lightning who's still in the lead. Then, with two to go from Fujin Style and Magnus Middleton. Then comes Sasa Park. Bally Galley Straight is going next. Then comes Renava and Groomy Grey. Probably share fast enough to that one, but they haven't got past this White Lightning yet. There's only a foot on to go. White Lightning's been in the lead all the way. Here comes Fujin Style up the center of the truck with a strong looking run. And Fujin Star bursts in the lead to take it. It's Fujin Star who's going to take it from a fast finishing Santa Rosa Isati and then Provence here faster. So a 1 2 for Vinnie Gerard. Decided to give everybody a little play last week. I'm going to have a few winners on the board, and this week he's come to claim his crown back by the looks of it because he's taken a 1 2 there. Fujin Star the winner. Santa Rosa Isati was second, Provence faster for David Robertson was third. Natalie Portman, I didn't get a mention in the race, ran on well to be fourth. Those Danny Hughes horses normally come from the back. Latrapanga for Darren Thompson was fifth. Bally Galley straight ran on well to be sixth. Renava and Groomy Gray for lower trainers didn't do too badly either. And the long time leader seemed to drop right out of it in the end. White London and only finished 11th but was in the lead for an awful long way.